we're using a traffic adaptive technology uh, from this one company, and um, we've got it deployed at uh, two and two and Gulf Road and two and two and Mall Boulevard out in front of the King of Prussia Plaza. These are actually the cameras we're looking at right now, and um, these have been deployed for 18 months. We uh, brought this in to see if this technology was viable, it was good, because it's brand new technology, and from all the reports and everything we've seen and the engineering study, this uh, has improved traffic flow by 50% easily. The regular signals have a timing plan, and then there's a cycle of 120 seconds. So we would have Main Street would get 60 seconds guaranteed green time, while Side Street would be able to get the rest if the car came up. So since there was no way of telling if there was cars on Main Street, if nobody was there, you would actually be wasting green time. Now with this technology, we are detecting cars as these zones, and we don't have a cycle anymore. So if the straight through movement needs 15 seconds and the side street needs 30, we can do that now. If this needs 50 seconds and this needs 10 seconds, we can do that. And if this needs to run forever, how long, because there's nobody here, it can also do that. So the technology now, and it adapts to the flow. So as the volume builds up, the time changes. And as the volume backs off, they don't, the time changes down. So it's always adapting to the flow, because we can see over here at 202, we now have a lot heavier traffic at this time. So this cycle for that signal will probably be close to 40 seconds, whereas maybe two minutes ago it was only 15 to 20 seconds. Um, yeah, we were ordered to do the eight remaining signals on 202, so that goes from um, Mall Boulevard down to the Dan Howard Bridge. Um, right now it's in the preliminary stage. PennDOT has sent uh, letters of agreements to the municipalities that were awarded the grant. And after they receive those, we'll have a meeting. And then once their meeting uh, is done, they'll tell us you know, what the details are, and then we'll go forward. I'm hoping and expecting that maybe this will be October we can start. Uh, this might take, I'm hoping this takes us two months to do, maybe a little less. So the sooner we get it done, I'd like to get it done by, uh, you know, Black Friday as we call it out here. So uh, the main benefit is, is now we'll be able to platoon traffic through Upper Merriam much more efficiently. We're hoping to reduce the stops and the delays that people get, you know, on the main movement, which is 202, by a minimum of 50%. We're hoping to see a 70% reduction.